Yo, yo, YouTube. I just got done watching Dune. And this movie is amazing. Um, it's easily one of the best movies of the year. Um, like, top ten movies I've seen in the last five years. Um, it has everything you want. However... There's so many good characters in this movie. Like, the cast is just so perfect. And they kill a lot of them. Jason Momoa's character loved him, killed him. Oscar Isaac's character loved him, killed him. Uh, who else? I don't know. But that was something where I was like, God, no one. Yeah, they better make two and three because they killed off a lot of characters. And I, and I agree with the people who said it. it, it doesn't even really end on a cliffhanger. It just kind of like ends. But I felt like it had, it wrapped up. Like I felt like it was a, it could be its own standalone story. Obviously they're like, you can tell that this is like a good first act, like a good basically three hour first act of a trilogy. Um, yes, had some, it had some, uh, Star Wars parallels, and like the first Star Wars, I liked, I liked um, Paul's progression of his, you know, powers and him like figuring out like who he is, and I loved how the story was about, you know, like a, a lot of political nonsense going on, like Poe, po, Oscar Isaac's character, uh, the Duke. Uh, at the beginning, he's like, this is politically dangerous. And, he, you know, he knew it. He saw it coming. Uh, I love how the doctor double-crossed, but kind of knew he was going to get then triple-crossed. Uh, and the, the tooth thing with the emperor. But the emperor is still at, at large, if I'm correct. What happened to Josh Brolin's character? I missed that. I'm going to have to go back and check it out because I loved him. But he, I don't really remember what happened to him. Uh, was he part of like the, just the big wipeout of uh, Arrakis? <clears throat> um, Chalamet crushed it. It's the second Timothy Chalamet movie I've watched today. Uh, I watched Beautiful Boy with him and Steve Carell. Whew. Brutal. Uh, but he was great. Um, oh, gosh, I made sure to check. The actress's name who plays the mom, who plays Lady Atreides, and I can't remember. But she was terrific. Um, uh, it was cool seeing Dave Bautista be like a mean Drax. Um, Jason Momoa's character was awesome. I'm really pissed that they killed him off. Uh, and I'm, I'm a little confused at the end when he, you know basically, you know, becomes one with the Force and whips that guy, Jameis. Wasn't he one of the guys in the, uh, like, dreams that he had? Like, weren't they friends in the future? Kind of confused there. Javier Bardem and his mom, I see that happening. I see his mom really jealous. Like, when, they, when Zendaya is, like, the final line of the movie, she's like, this is only just the beginning. And they start walking away, and... Uh, they're headed to one of their little, like, communities, I guess. It's called, like, a sheaf, a steef. I forget, but uh, it's, like, a safe haven away from the the, the uh, spice mines. Uh, the mom gives that, like, smile to him, and then he turns around and walks away, and she does this. She is worried, her little boy. <sighs> But anyway, it was a great movie. Um, it was long, but guess what? I want a lot more. So like Warner Brothers and Discovery and all the people that make the decisions to fund this movie, get, get your acts together and make this happen. Like sign contracts, put it, write it in stone, carve it in stone. Uh, but we need the this story to end. And remember, I knew nothing about Dune. I knew nothing. Uh, it was so easy to follow. Uh, I thought that was going to be so difficult, but it wasn't. And I love how the mom had this side gig. And you know what? I should have known because I liked Oscar Isaac and I liked Jason Momoa's characters. And I even liked the doctor character. 
I feel like she might be coming back. But anyway, you can tell who's gonna die because they're just too nice. And the mom's got this like dark secret hidden shit so she survives. Thought that was kind of funny. Um, the sandworm was cool. I don't think the sandworm stopped because of the thumper. I think it eventually went away because of the, that thumper. But I think it stopped because it like recognized him. Maybe. I don't know. Let me know what you guys think if you saw Dune. It was great. I, uh, I will most likely watch it again. Uh, I didn't move. I sat on the couch the entire movie. I did not budge. Uh, it held my attention from start to finish. Um, it was awesome. Definitely go see it in the theater because I didn't. And if you made it this long, let me know. I'll see you next week. I gotta go.